Hey guys, so today I'm here with a tutorial showing you how to jailbreak your iPhone, iPod Touch, or iPad on 4.2.1 running Windows. Uh, so the way we're going to be doing it today is using Green Poison, which is the latest jailbreak tool, and it's going to be your best bet. Uh, before we begin, I do want to mention a couple of things. Um, first of all, using Green Poison, you are going to need only a couple of devices. It supports almost all, but not quite. Uh, it will support the iPod Touch 2nd generation. Doesn't matter, MB, MC model. All iPod Touch 2nd generations are supported. Uh, same goes for the iPod Touch 3rd generation, the iPod Touch 4th generation, the iPhone 3GS, doesn't matter what boot ROM it is, the iPhone 4, as well as the iPad. Now what this does not support is the iPhone 3G, so if you have that 3G, you're not going to be able to do this. It also does not support the Apple TV yet. Apple TV support will be coming very soon. Now do keep in mind that you will need to be on iOS 4.2.1 for this jailbreak to work. If you're on some earlier version, you're going to need to update and then run the jailbreak. Uh, so without any further ado, let's just go ahead and jump straight on into it. Uh, the first thing you're going to need to do is go ahead and download Green Poison for your Windows computer. Um, I will have a link in the description. Uh, the servers are getting hammered right now, so I'll have a couple of different links. If one of them isn't working, just try the other and you should be able to get in no problem. Okay, so now that you have Green Poison downloaded, it's going to be pretty simple. Uh, now before we begin, there is just one last step I do want to mention. Uh, now while this is not necessary, I definitely do recommend that you take uh, connect your device, uh, obviously via USB, um, connect it and uh, let it fully sync up with iTunes. Uh, now, you should not lose your data in this jailbreak, but as a general rule of thumb, I always recommend back your stuff up. Um, it's not going to, you know, just going to take just a minute to do it. And that way, no matter what happens, you will be covered. So if for some, for some reason the jailbreak goes wrong, all you got to do, plug your device in, restore, you have all your data back, and you're good to go. Um, at any rate, uh, go ahead and just plug your device in, uh, you know, go ahead and sync, and we're ready to begin. Um, so, as you guys can see here, I am on 4.2.1. Uh, now, what we're going to be doing today is putting it into DFU mode. So, I recommend going ahead and just shutting off the other device, make sure it's totally off. i right, give it just a minute here. And then we're going to go ahead and go through the steps for DFU mode. So, we're all good. Uh, now, over here in Green Poison, it will go ahead and tell you to prepare to jailbreak. Uh, we're going to need to be pressed the hold, hold, uh, hold the hold power button, I'm sorry, hold the power button for about 3 seconds, then hold the home button as well for 10 seconds, release the power button, continue holding the home button until it says that we're good to go. So let's just go ahead and do it. Um, I will tell you guys how to do it, and of course walk you through it, and there's a little timer here. So we'll click on this. It says get ready, 3, 2, 1, start holding the home button, power button. <laughs> now we're holding the power and the home button for 10 seconds. Be sure to keep a firm hold on, if you have a case you might want to remove it, because it's easy to lose a button. Um, you have to restart, and now we're going to release the uh, power button and continue holding the home button. Uh, so it says 15 seconds, usually doesn't take quite that long, but we'll go ahead and continue holding it. And there we go. So, as you can see, we can just set our device down, and it says we're ready to jailbreak, and it will hit the jailbreak button. So I'll go ahead and just move this over and show you guys the process. We'll hit jailbreak. Um, it'll take just a moment here to get all set up, but we're pretty much done now. All we got to do is just give Green Poison a few minutes. See the uh, loading screen will go through, and it will go ahead and run some lines of code. But as soon as you get th to this point, you know that we're good. So I'll go ahead and just cut, and I'll be right back as soon as it's done. Okay, so it just finished. So that was pretty simple. Now there's only one more step, and we're going to be good to go. So you should see a brand new uh, app on your home screen called Loader. I need to open this up. And what we need to do is download Cydia. This should be very simple. Uh, all you need to do is just tap on Cydia and click install. Now it will, again it will download, this should not take very long and install. So as soon as this is done we'll be good to go. Okay so after a quick respring you should now see Cydia on your device. Congratulations you are now officially jailbroken. Feel free to go download all the cool jailbreak apps you like. Uh, now if you do have any questions, any problems whatsoever, be sure to leave them in the comment section below and I will help, out as, uh, help you out as best I can. And if this video helps you out, please thumbs up the video and uh, subscribe for more jailbreak content. I really appreciate that. It helps me get you guys more jailbreak uh, you know, tutorials and videos and all that kind of stuff. So yeah. Anyway guys, thanks for watching.